figo ni kiungo cha mwili ambacho kazi yake kuu ni kusafisha damu licha ya kwamba ukubwa wake ni sawia na ngumi tu ni mojawapo ya viungo vya mwili ambavyo vinachangia pakubwa uhai wa mtu hata hivyo tatizo la figo linaweza kumfanya mtu akakosa hata uwezo wa kusafisha damu na hivyo basi kusalia kusafishwa damu kwa kutumia mashine maalum al maarufu dialysis au hata kupandikizwa figo ya mtu mwingine kama njia kuhakikisha kwamba uchafu wote wa damu unatolewa kwa njia ya mkojo My name is Millicent Njeri I'm a post kidney, post kidney transplant patient My transplant was done in January 2013 but before then i was doing dialysis from 2010 to that january 2013 i was diagnosed in 2000 and the doctor said the cause the cause of the failure was acute glomerular nephritis that is the low kidney function and i was put under medication for 4 years and at 2004 i got well and my life had been so good hata hivyo afya yake ilidorora hata zaidi mwaka 2009 baada ya kupata mtoto wake wa kwanza at first we were in denial and we we decided to first seek other options which almost costed my life Anasema kwamba upandikizaji wa figo aliyofanyiwa ulimpa fueni. Kwa wengi wanaogua ugonjwa wa figo, upandikizaji wa kiungo hiki cha mwili kama moja wapo ya mbinu za matibabu huwa ni afueni. Lakini je, unafahamu kwamba usipozingatia ushauri wa daktari huenda mwili wako ukakosa kufahamiana na kiungo hiki? Daktari wa magonjwa ya figo Ahmed Sokwala anasema kwamba mwili unaweza kukosa kufahamiana na figo iliyopandikizwa kwa kosa la kutomeza dawa jinsi ilivyoshauriwa na daktari. When you don't take medications the immunity increases and the body realizes that there is a foreign body inside a person's body and the, you know it forms simple term soldiers to go and fight that organ and that's what we call rejection. So kwala anasema kwamba baadhi ya dalili ambazo zinaashiria kutofahamiana kwa mwili na figo iliyopandikizwa ni kama fever you can get you know blood in the urine you can get pain at the site of the new kidney your urine becoming a little more frothy your legs start swelling hata hivyo anaongezea kwamba baada ya upandikizaji huu mgonjwa huyo atasalia kutumia dawa katika maisha yake yote jambo ambalo wagonjwa wengi husema huwa changamoto ikizingatiwa bei ghali ya dawa hizo for the medications blood test doctors visit would be around 40 to 50000 a month okay and that's you know quite a burden to the patient because right now nhif pays for the dialysis so people would say i'd rather do dialysis i don't need to pay all that money men should step in and also cater for the post transplant medication vile vile anashauri kwamba ni sharti mgonjwa aliyepandikizwa figo kuzingatia afya na lishe bora wash your hands you know regularly before you know you start eating after you go to the washroom washing hands is very important avoid very many you know crowded places uh, where you know you, you're susceptible to more infections avoid uncooked food things like salads you know cook foods which have stayed in the fridge for a long time Gloria Milimo K24 Makala ya Raina Seha